the Miami Marlins, who are 13 and 11, head to at home Marlins Park against the New York Mets, who lead the East 18 and 8. This game will go down in the books. The Grom, 2 and 0 on the year with a 2.29 ERA, and Paxton will have a day 1 and 2, 2.59 ERA. Now, top of the first. 3-0 count to the batter, Travis Shaw, he'll ground out to Prado. Top of the second, 1-1 count to the batter, he'll fly out to Stanton in two innings, no hit baseball. Top of the third, to Grom up, 1-1 count, Tellis will fill it and throw it to Boer. And end of three, runner on second for David Wright, pop that foul territory, Boer will make the catch. Three and five, four, no hit innings. Now, ground up to Echeverria, to Gordon, to Boer, and a double play. Bottom of the third, I mean fifth, D. Gordon up with two runners on. Now it'll go into the gap. Gordon will round second. Tellus will round second as well. They're both rounding third, and they're going to try to get home. Here comes the throw home. Two runs are going to score. Gordon gets caught up. He'll He's run, trying to run back. He gets in the rundown, and he'll get tagged out by the catcher. Two runs now. Top of the third. 3-2 count to worth and he'll strike out of high heat i mean a uh, heat inside dave right up one one count he'll fly this to yelich yelich will make the catch and seven no hit innings top of the eighth three two count to the batter he'll line this to left field bradley jr is there now he's up in the bottom of the eighth two outs in the inning and just insurance right there that is gonna be deep and gone bradley jr's uh, I believe 8th home run on the year. It gives the Marlins a 3-0 lead as we head into the ninth. 3 outs away from a no-hitter for James Paxton. 1-2 count to the batter. Drop this to the right field. Boer fields it. Throw the Paxton. 2 down now. Here is Jonas Cespedes. Pitch hitting for the pitcher. Was not in the ball game. 1-2 count. He pops this to Gordon in right field. Gordon will make the catch. 2 1 out away. 0-2 oh, count to Worth. He'll pop this up to left field. Bradley Jr. is under it. And James Patton has thrown the sixth no-hitter in Miami Marlins franchise history. The last time it, Marlin has thrown a no-hitter was the September 29th of 2013 when Henderson Alvarez got a no-hitter in X, not, uh, by a walk-off as he threw a no-hitter against the Tigers. James Paxton in his second year as a Miami Marlin throws a no-hitter, only two walks allowed, and that will be it. Paxton, a great pitcher and best start of the year by far. We'll see you in the next one.